So you're a big fan of The Cove? A huge fan of The Cove. How many of you have seen that movie? Everybody has to see it. I'm telling you, that movie will, will absolutely change your life. It is one of the most powerful movies I've ever personally seen. And, and he actually, I believe, works with another man named Paul Watson who does a documentary TV show called Whale Wars, which is something else that will change your life. That's it's right. pretty phenomenal. That's right. We got to take care there. of our brothers and sisters in the ocean. I'm here. You know what? So here, here's, here's the news for you. Okay. When 90210 was on, I lived in a condo in L.A., and my wife and I at 8 o'clock would time dinner perfectly, and we never missed an episode. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> of course, I used to eat back then. Now I don't even watch no, TV. You don't but I, 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 didn't, I, don't, I used to drive around L.A. looking for the peach pit. Okay, well, you know that, that I'm, I, I watched your sitcom, and I still do. It's, it's actually it's on really late at night, so I go to sleep. Thanks. No, it's not. <laughs> you, watch, you watch me, I put your ass to sleep. You're like, I'm out. That's got you. I heard that. So you know what? No. I got you this in case you want to take a nap during Yay. the day. All right? If you want to sleep, you know, afternoon nap before you start dancing. This is honestly, it's <laughs> such a great show. I love watching this show. And not just because, you know. Well, I'm happy that I'm a huge fan of Dancing with the Stars. I used to go see Mario Lopez, and, and this year is an amazing assortment of people. It is. It's, it's, a, it's a really good, interesting cast, that's for sure. Yes. Uh, 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 we'll get to those people. But, uh -huh. but they've been asking you since year one, and you've always said no. Yes, I have a uh, tremendous fear of live audiences. Hi, guys. <laughs> Um, but I'm not just a tremendous kind of fear. quaking right now. But yeah, you, you can't. You don't like to be in public. No, no. But, and you, and you hive up. I'm I'm I'm. If you can see, I'm getting like a red scratch marks right here, right now. And I started itching on my stomach right before I stepped out here. I get hives really bad. So, and I have to be in front of a live audience two times a week starting next week. So I I, I I'm in trouble. I'm in and trouble. And dancing. Well, wait a minute, so how, how can we do, how can we remedy that? What do, you, what do you need? My partner, Mark, said that he was gonna put rhinestones all over my hives, so that basically <laughs> I was just gonna sparkle nonstop. You're gonna look like some hoochie's <laughs> iPhone, man. You're gonna be all sparkly. You're gonna be all sparkly, You're just like yeah. two eyes. Yeah. Two eyes coming out of some sparkles. Yes. Okay, so, so now you decided to do it. Tell everybody, I think this is an amazing, I'm, I'm a father, so tell everybody why you decided to, to do it. Um, my, uh, I, 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 I sometimes cry telling this That's story, okay. so I apologize. My dad is, has had, has been sick for a really long time. He's had nine strokes and, uh, like eight heart attacks. And Christmas, this past Christmas, he had his 10th stroke, but it was a massive, massive stroke. And it left him with no speech and, uh, no mobility and depressed. And, and he was in the hospital for a month and he didn't want to, you know, try. People give up after a certain yeah. period of time. And uh, he, he loves Dancing with the Stars. And I went to the hospital, and, and, and I thought I was just going to make him laugh. And I said, you know, Dad, I got offered Dancing with the Stars. It's that time <laughs> of the year, you know. And, and his face lit up. And he could say at that time, he's, he's gotten a little bit better. At that time, he could say, yeah, yeah. And so he was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, no, 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 no. <laughs> You're not making me do this. And I struck a deal with him, and the deal was that if he gets out of that bed and he tries to take five steps down the corridor of the hospital, if he tries to learn a new word every single day, that I would face my fear of a live audience and I right. would do the show for him. And that's why I'm doing it. It's a negotiation tactic. I use it every day. <laughs> um, so it's, it's fantastic. Kind of and there's a picture of you with your pops. That's great. So now we know now well now I know who I'm voting for every week. So <laughs> all right. So I think we're I'm, uh, and as I watch weekly, will I see you become more orange like all these other <laughs> fools that dance? Yeah, it was kind of a big discussion. It was like are you gonna go to the tanning salon or are you gonna get a mystic tan? And if you get the mystic tan, you have to mystic tan like several times a week. And so I said no because I have fair skin and dark hair and it's my thing and, and I like it and I think it's, you know, it's a little safer. It's, it's yeah. you know, we're not promoting skin cancer anymore, right? No. So why do we need to be orange? Who, who do you think is the biggest competition? 
I mean, it's a little early to tell. Come I think, on, but there, there's... I, I think there's some obvious choices for sure. Uh, Nicole from the Pussycat Dolls. I mean, I right? Mean, she, she's the leader of the Pussycat Dolls. <laughs> she can dance. I mean, that's what they do. They're dancers. Yeah, for sure. But, you know, I mean, whatever. I, I think it's... She's actually really nice, and, and uh, I've met her a bunch of times. What about uh, um, Jane Gosling? What's, that? What's her name? Kate. <laughs> <laughs> What about her, the lady with a bunch of kids? What, what about her? I'm a Latino, that's how I describe them. The lady that has the kids running around all over. How, how's, how do you think she's gonna do? I don't know. Somebody asked her who, who she thought her competition was, and she said Nicole and Pam, and she totally left me out. No, that's like, Jack, man. What do you mean? She's my, tripping, but I already I heard she was like tripping. Out? Yeah, I heard she was tripping already. Like, you can't look at her, and you can't dance where she danced. I mean, crazy <laughs> shit. You're like, come on. Really? You're from TLC, homegirl. What are you doing? <laughs> you can't trip. You're from TLC. You know. So uh, I actually, I actually haven't met her, so I have no idea. I know idea. you're trying to be all neutral. It's cool. <laughs> you, 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 you talk with your I feet. I'm gonna go I'll, like I'll do the jokes and, and you talk it's, with. Yeah, right. you're already all hyped out over here when <laughs> I start <to> talking. <laughs> so I'm watching. I'm gonna go down. I wish you the best, and you're a good daughter. Thank I you. love that. Thank you. The 10th season of premiere of Dancing with the Stars airs on Monday at 8 o'clock. <laughs> Shannon Doherty. <laughs> Canadian hype man's coming out, so stay where you are. Watch out.